Greetings, my Guild of Glorious Gargantuans. It is I, Griffior, and we are back with Grand Theft Auto V. I took a little bit of a hiatus from the game, just a little bit, but, you know, now everything's all good. Mainly it's because of a lot of uh, technical issues, but oh well. But, um, yeah, so I'll be trying to get these up, mainly GTA V up, um, like I used to do my other videos, just one a day. And still doing the other miscellaneous games uh, one a day throughout the week. So that's two videos a day, which, you know, it's going to be tough. But, you know, I'm going to manage it for you guys. Anyway, we're playing as Michael and we're on our way to Leicester. Uh, we still owe Martin Madrazo, what was it, $2.5 million? So, yeah, I guess this is leading up to a heist or something. If I can figure out nope wrong highway wrong highway no Michael okay anyway um yeah so we found out our daughter uh, that Michael's daughter is stupid last episode that his son's kind of well really like me I don't like to go outside but I'm not a whiny fucking bitch either and what's your what else did we do last episode I can't really remember can't really remember God, I'm going to have problems remembering shit. I can't even fucking remember. I remember that. It oh, wait. Yeah, we we did drugs. Yeah. Yeah, that's why I can't remember. Because drugs impaired random shit. I don't fucking know. I don't know. I'm just trying to fucking hurry up and get over to Lester's place. Wherever he may be. Across the goddamn state. Eh, fuck off. So I wonder, like, you know, if GTA 5 is ever going, or not GTA 5, but if GTA is ever going to get to the point where if you do this, the cops call, or get called on you. Because, I mean, after a while, you know, it might happen. It'd be funny, though. Which I haven't gotten into any serious cop chases yet, and I'm trying to avoid that until I go online. I'll probably go online after I finish the campaign, because I got a bunch of friends that want to play and stuff, if they ever do. Okay, so is this, which, is this one Lester's, it's kind of open, maybe? I hear a dog. Maybe this is it? Yeah. Fuck you, Lester. You gonna let me in or what? Give me a minute. <sighs> okay, this dude. I was wondering when you'd show up. I was dead. Praise be. You weren't very dead. You need my help. How do you know? Because you came here. Why else would you? <clears throat> I haven't been a good friend for you, Lester. I know that. And you're going to make it up to me by doing whatever I ask. Or rather, I, I mean, I need something done. You need to know something. So why not help each other? I got to make some dough. So you're back in the game? I guess. Look, Lester, about what happened before. Oh, I know you never mentioned my name. I know I'm not on any lists anywhere. I know you never betrayed me. As for you, you gotta figure that I never told anyone that instead of gently decomposing in North Yankton, you're angrily decomposing in Los Santos with a shrink and a wife who don't love you no more. Yeah, yeah well, <laughs> since you put it like that. Hey, shut up a minute. I'm getting an eye find alert. That little college boy sack of shit, phony fuck. Who? Jay Norris? Yes. That fuck is a lying bastard. I've read his fucking emails. He's a fucking cheat. Uh, I heard him say that he saved America. What, by, by outsourcing all the jobs? By selling us little bits of plastic restricted access shit? Well, now it's payback time, you lying turd. What the hell are you talking about? You are about to get that white collar gig that you always dreamed of, Mikey. Here. Take this uh, fashionably retro weird for a 45-year-old man, but I cannot let go of the 1980s bag and dress yourself up like a billionaire math genius with low-level Asperger's. You better be ready for the minor glitch of your repulsive pseudo-messianic life. Okay, Lester. Get out of here! Call me when you're ready. We are about to put the Darwinism back in social Darwinism, and brother, it is gonna be fun. You fucking kidding me? I'm a bank robber, not a web designer. So we'll go robbing soon. I'll, I'll find something. Just like the old days. <laughs> Sorry. 
Okay, so apparently Lester hates whoever I'm getting ready to... I, I don't even know what I'm doing, fuck. He just gave me a backpack and told me to go somewhere. I guess that's typical Lester. Uh, yeah, I didn't really do a good job parking here. Like at all. Oh well. Okay. So... Well, I mean... <laughs> it sounds like... Uh, a lot of angry, well, I mean, it sounds like every angry citizen when they outsource jobs, but oh well. Okay, so, like, can I get a phone call for, from Lester or anything right now? I mean, he just told me to go somewhere. Okay. So, back on the fucking highway. That's always fun. You know, we could we could just, you know, go bank robbing, but no, we have to go fucking do something. I don't know. Was he serious about changing the clothes, though, or, or am I just crazy? I, I don't know. Okay. So, no, no, no. There we go, there we go. Okay. Still, this car handles a lot better than fucking the Franklin's. I'll say it every every day because it the every other vehicle except his just handles amazingly. His is just handles like shit. Okay. I would play the radio, but, you know, I, I don't like claims, you know, I, I, I don't think any YouTuber likes them. Okay, let's see here, where do we, okay, Suburban. Oh wait, we really do have to change clothes, wow. Okay. That's, uh, great. Ah, excuse me. I got this interview at this tech company. I'm thinking I need something, I don't know, geeky. Youthful. Lost your job and the world's moved on, huh? That's too bad. I didn't lose my job. Of course. Got too old, got outsourced. Same thing happened to my dad. Now you gotta fit in with a different generation. Hmm? What about a vest and some cargo shorts? Okay, we'll, we'll do that. Okay, so... Let's see here. Shorts. Nah, not camo. Sure, let's go with white. Oh my god, fucking... Okay, okay, where's the... Let's see, there's shirts. Didn't you say, like, vest or something? I don't fucking know. Let's do all white. Ew, no, definitely not. Okay. I'm looking for a fucking vest. Where is it? Or Gillette's. Oh, okay. This is it. Like a 404 error. Dignity aside, I think that might just work. It but might just work. Okay. Well, I was going to go for matching colors, but fuck it. We might need to find a new... Well, not find. Steal a new car. Okay, here we go. Some dialogue to tell us what's going Mike, on. I'm all dressed up. Now, you want to run me through this thing? The prototype is somewhere in the Life Invader office. Find it and fit it with the device in your bag. They just gonna let me in? Why wouldn't they if you looked the part? Hang around till someone opens the door and act entitled. Fine. Alright. I mean, it sounds about right, honestly. Oh, shit. There we go. Skills to pay the bills. No, you asshole. Why the fuck would you go when we have a red light? dickhead okay okay here's the life invader building you can tell about the giant fucking L okay since I have to act entitled I'll just park like this like a complete asshole okay so let's head up here and get a little cutscene Hey, hey. Uh, oh, great. Uh, PM's pushing for more functionality. <laughs> but we are maxed. I mean, if anything, we have to strip features, especially if we plan on releasing a fully yeah. priced update a year later. Oh, my. You know, it's. Yeah, well, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? I mean, we're talking beta in Q4, maybe Q3. Look, milestones are one thing, but when design is changing its mind yeah. seemingly overnight, there's not much you can do about it. You Look, know what I'm saying? Uh, my union allocated smoke breaks about up, so... Wait a minute. Do I know you? 
Yeah, I think so. I, I, I tea temp, right? Yeah. You know, you gotta do something for me. Ah, uh, you gotta put it in a ticket. Ah, uh, no. I'd like to keep this one out of the database, if you know what I mean. I'm turning consultant when we release. Consulting consulters. You know, a consultancy, consultancy, consultancy. Oh, please I'm shut up. On the conference tour already. God. Don't, Don't tell me this is another fucking Jimmy of some sorts. Hi. Oh, hi. Chill out on the beanbag. Marcus will be right out. Oh, um, I'm gonna take a normal chair. I have a terrible back. A normal chair? What kind of fucking other chairs do you have in this place? Oh. Here you go. If you guys let me use the OS I requested, this wouldn't be a problem. This is a filthy hard drive, bro. Oh my god. Uh, got any antivirus software? I think oh, so. I should use a mouse. On Hold on. Clicked an NSFW link, bro. Bit me on the ass. Yeah, not safe for work, huh? You know, my son's computer runs into the same kind of problems. I'll close the pop-ups, see what I can do. There you go. Wow. How about I run the antivirus software? Uh, okay. And now we scan. Scanning. Come on. Might I tempt you with some organic chow or a fair trade java? Almost cracked it. Exterminate. And that should do it. Should Why don't do you it. try and keep things strictly safe for work from now on? Hey, have you seen the prototype in the demo? Who fucking does when that? Morris announces it at the keynote. Mines are gonna blow. Yes, they are. Dude, please stop. Okay, rig the prototype. What's it, what's he gonna do? Like make it? Is he gonna make it like the Xbox One announcement at E3? You know, way back when. Was just like utter shit. What's he doing? Oh, nice. Why did you leave your bag there? Making history, dude. Hey, and like, I couldn't do it without Okay, whatever. Guys. Goodbye. Dude, please stop. Invader Cafe. Okay, awesome. What fucking idiots. Can you, like, run? Can you go, like, please run or something? Oh, wait, no, we don't go this way. Please. What the fuck? Do people really act like that? I want well, I guess somewhere hopefully not I still have faith in humanity oh look look what we're getting ready to steal okay hey Michael hold on hold on Dome, they doomed you. Lester the things in the prototype I'm going home to watch the keynote teabag time my friend Lester did you hear me are you playing that game? Yeah, yeah, sorry. Phone is rigged. Hey, what's your problem? You don't like shooters? They're all the same. Besides, you know me. I'm a movie guy. Classic Vinewood. Classic Vinewood ended 30 years ago. Now it's just superheroes, romantic comedies, and remakes. None of which interest me. Hey, I believe this country can still make interesting movies. There's no better way to define American life than a two-hour plot in which the hero looks good and defeats evil. Ah, uh, whatever you say. Enjoy yesterday. Anyway, just call the device after he's unveiled it, and then we'll talk. Okay. Okay, so, I guess, well, he was going to watch the Kino. <laughs> oh my god, you guys are so lame! No, I'm watching Fame or Shame! The no, fucking tits! Give me up! You guys are going to the final. God. God! Okay. So wait for Jay Norris to pull out the prototype phone and then give him a call. Hey. This company has come a long way since we started it in my parents' pool house in East Carroll. Today, 
you're about to witness a new phase. Full-on, weapons-grade, red alert, world domination. Weasel news, wow. Private data in the public domain, and we have milked every penny we could in the process. And we have one of the youngest workforces in the world. An average age of only 14.4 years. What the That's fuck was that? Impressive. It's revolutionary. Was that just like a random explosion outside Michael's house? I think it was. Today, right here, we are about to make the next step. Prepare to witness the future. What the fuck? The Life Invader mobile device. Yes, we've invented something no one else has ever thought of. A small, personal, computerized device. Now you're going to be able to stay docked 24-7. On the bus, you can dock. Uh... On the subway, stay docked. You can be docked at home. And at the same time, you're docking with... Oh, hold on a second. I think someone's trying to dock with me. What the fuck? Oh, Jesus. Whoa. No, 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 Let's... No, no, no. Whoa. What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> well. All right. Well, since uh Yes, please get me out of these fucking clothes. Uh. <laughs> Last, that was heavy. Are you watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till close. All right. Hey, about that other thing. You know the score. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Put on a suit, look somewhat professional, and meet me at my warehouse off the LS freeway. Oh, uh, and I'm about to email you a link for the exchange. You can put in some trades of your own. Uh, I'm trying to stay off the day trading. Uh, but maybe I'll take a look. Okay, so let's go ahead and change clothes. He wants a suit. Like a white suit or gray and white, whatever. Wish I had a black suit, but eh. Okay, we'll stick with this. Anyway, we'll stop right here since this one mission took almost fucking 20 minutes. So anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had fun. Please leave a like, favorite, comment, tell me what was your favorite part. Share it with your friends and family. And subscribe to the Guild of Glorious Gargantuans if you are not already a Glorious Gargantuan. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.